I've got the F-18 out today. It's a windy day and I want to test out how it behaves in the tailwind. I've got this set up as a elevator and aileron plane. I added thrust vectoring on to the elevator. But for better control in the tailwind, I've done the 4x4 setup where I've got the ailerons and elevons moving together. Combine that with the thrust vectoring and we should have some pretty good control in the tailwind as long as the prop wash is going faster than the wind. <laughs> So what I'm trying out today is gaining control of the plane in a tailwind. I've got it set up right now with the ailerons and elevator. And right now I'm trying to, with the tailwind, I'm trying to get the plane to turn. And uh, when the wind hits the, the aileron from behind, it's actually pushing the plane the opposite direction of where you want to go. It kind of balances it out. So you get very little control. Whoa. And here I'm rocking the control back and forth, and it's really not doing much. All I can do is get some height. The thrust vectoring is helping me get some altitude, but that's about it. Now I'm going to switch on the 4x4 control where I can get some thrust vectoring to help me out in a tailwind. All right, so we got the wind coming from behind. I've got total control of the plane with the thrust vectoring. As long as the thrust is greater than the tailwind, I can get some control.